People living with kidney failure can soon look forward to a future without dialysis or an endless wait for a transplant organ. Combining continuous treatment with total mobility, the implantable bioartificial kidney will give patients back their health, freedom, and quality of life. The compact device will replicate many functions of healthy kidneys and will not require immunosuppression drugs. The bioartificial kidney combines a mechanical hemofilter to remove toxins from blood and a bioreactor containing engineered renal tubule cells to maintain water volume, electrolyte balance, and metabolic functions. Highly efficient membranes constructed from semiconductor silicon wafers enable filtration without requiring pumps or electrical power while protecting the renal cells from rejection by the patient's immune system. The biocompatible device attaches to the circulatory system and removes toxins to the bladder as waste. After a decade of engineering development to refine the hemofilter and bioreactor components, preclinical prototypes of the implantable bioartificial kidney have been successfully created. Clean room microfabrication processes have been established to reliably produce high quality silicon membranes. Tissue culture protocols have also been optimized to reproducibly grow renal tubule cells and maintain their function. The silicon membranes were mounted in polycarbonate housing to construct hemofilters, and in similar fashion, bioreactors were assembled to immunoprotect the renal tubule cells. The hemofilter and bioreactor components were then connected to create bioartificial kidney prototypes for benchtop and preclinical testing. In proof of concept experiments, the hemofilter operated under blood pressure alone without systemic anticoagulation, while the renal cells in the bioreactor remained alive and healthy without immunosuppression. Further improvements will scale up the prototypes with additional silicon membranes and renal cells, creating clinical devices that can demonstrate sustained treatment of kidney failure in human trials. The implantable bioartificial kidney will provide the therapy and mobility patients need to move beyond the burdens of dialysis and organ shortage and once again enjoy the freedoms of everyday life. Shalom Akim. First and foremost, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Yahweh Double honors to the elders and apostles at Great Millstone. Peace and salutations to the elect. And I just want to go into a quick lesson, which is surrounded by, you know, this video that you just seen, you know, uh, concerning this new device that Esau Edom has created, which is a, uh, well, as he said, you know, a bio artificial uh, kidney. So this is a device, you know, he plans on using to replace, you know, uh, the kidneys. And he's using it, you know, uh, saying that it's, <clears throat> you know, to replace, uh, you know, people that have uh, bad kidneys because kidney disease affects so many uh, individuals. And, you know, if you have a spiritual eye, okay, as the scripture says, you know, the son of perdition, you know, or the, the man of sin, you know, Salaki will be uh, revealed, man. And devices like this, you know, just proves, you know, more and more who this man is. You know, only uh, somebody that worships the spiritual demon Satan will come up with something like this, man. You know, so uh, we're going to hit a few uh, precepts and then we're going to close it out. This is Second Thessalonians. Uh, let's see. I started the first verse, uh, 2 Thessalonians 2 and 1. It says, Now we beseech you, brethren, by the coming of our Lord, Yahweh Shai Hamashiach, and by our gathering together unto him, that ye be not soon shaken in mind or be troubled, neither by spirit, nor by word, nor by letter as from us, as that the day of Hamashiach is at hand. And it's apparent, you know, that a move has to be made against this damn devil, man. Okay, the rate that he's going. You know, he'll he'll change everybody. He'll make everybody, you know, uh, artificial. 
completely change, you know, the creation of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai. Okay, and we know one thing that Yahweh Shai is coming back down here to do is to establish order down here upon the earth. Okay, and part of that order is taking out Esau Edom. Okay, because this man's out of control. It says, let no man deceive you by any means for that day shall not come except there come a falling away first. And that day that it's talking about is, you know, uh, the destruction, the restoration of the uh, Israelites as the ruling power down here upon the earth. Okay, so that day is not going to come except there come a falling away first, which was the nation of Israel, you know, losing the wisdom, knowledge and understanding of Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai going into captivity. It says in that man of sin be revealed the son of perdition. Okay. And if we were in power, this man would not be able to get the foothold that he has now. Okay. He would not have been able to deceive the world. Like it says in Revelation, the 20th chapter, because we would be there telling everybody this, this dude's the devil, man. Okay. Us as the representatives of the heavenly father down here upon the earth, the madness that this man has been pushing out. If we weren't in that dead state, it would have been checked. Okay, so the Heavenly Father, you know, for prophecy's sake, allowed us to go into that dead state. So, you know, this man could be revealed in the last days, man. Because nobody that represents the Heavenly Father, nobody that represents the Creator, would be doing the things that this man is doing. Okay? It says in that man of sin be revealed the son of perdition. And you can see, you know, that he's the man of sin. What is he promoting? You can do whatever you want to do, okay? There's not really going to be uh, consequences to your actions because, look, my technology can repair you, okay? The reason why you get kidney disease is because of your diet, man. The things you put in your body is certain things you're not supposed to eat. And the Heavenly Father told us that, okay? In the scriptures, there's a dietary law, man. But under, you know, the authority of Esau, Edom, you can do whatever you want to do. You can eat whatever you want to eat. And now here he comes with the solution to the judgment that Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai brings upon you for committing sin, man. For you eating whatever you want to eat, the Most High destroys your kidney. He'll take your kidney away. You know, so here's Esau Edom, okay, coming with the solution to the, uh, you know, side effects of committing sin, saying, look, I'm going to give you artificial kidneys. So you can eat whatever you want to eat. Now you won't have those uh, side effects from eating things that you're not supposed to eat, okay? This kidney filters all things out. It won't get to a point to where it's going to break down. Or if it does break down, we can just go in, you know, and fix it. And you, you'll be good as new. Okay? See, the Most High set these bodies up to where if you commit sin, if you commit iniquity, certain things are going to happen to you, man. This man wants to establish a system or have a society where you can do whatever you want to as long as you don't go against what he says. And nothing's going to happen to you. The judgments of the Heavenly Father will not, you know, come down upon you because I'm going to give you a body that's going to be, uh, what's the word? Uh, Non-susceptible to being judged by the Heavenly Father, just as you see with this kidney here, man. Okay? And the other inventions that this, this damn devil has come up with, you know, restoring uh, eyesight, you know? <clears throat> It says in that man of sin be revealed the son of perdition. You can see why this man is going to be destroyed. Verse 4 says, Who opposeth and exalteth himself above all that is called the Most High. And with this invention, he's exalting himself above the Heavenly Father. Okay? Basically, what he's saying with this invention is that the Most High messed up on the kidney. No, the kidney functions very well, man. Okay? When you use the kidney properly, okay, when you use the, the organs of the body properly, Okay, how the Heavenly Father intended them to be used is not going to be a problem, man. Okay, and also when you're doing the things that please the Heavenly Father, you're not going to have a problem with your organs, man. Okay, but when you disobey the commandments of Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai, then judgment comes down upon you. Okay, this devil really going all the way back to the beginning. That's what he's been saying, man. Look, the Most High, you know, he's cruel, he's vindictive, you know. He, he wants to constrain you, but I'm here to, to liberate man down here upon the earth so look you can eat whatever you want to eat but i'm gonna have you know this device so when your kidney fails okay the kidney that the most high made by the way when that kidney fails i'm gonna give you a new one so you can continue to live that free lifestyle that you want to live you know that's pleasurable to you 
It says, who opposed and exalted himself above all that is called the Most High, okay? And the things that the Most High created for individuals that do have kidney problems, you know, there's uh, herbs down here that you can use to clean your kidneys out, to clean all your organs. You know, there's certain herbs and certain diet that you're supposed to, you know, get on, okay, or that you can get on to filter out your organs, okay? This damn devil saying, nah, the hell with that, that don't work. You know, the system that the Most High created doesn't work. I got, you know, this invention that's going to fix everything, you know. So this is another way how he opposes the Most High. He doesn't want to implement what the Most High set forth down here, man. Not once is you going to hear this damn devil say that you can take herbs, you know, to uh, uh, cleanse yourself, man, to clean your body. Okay, to clean uh, your organs. out. He's not going to say that because he's the devil. All right, he opposes everything that Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai stands for. This is Sirach 38 and 4. It says, The Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai hath created medicines out of the earth, which is the different herbs that's down here. Okay, the plants, you know. There's also uh, other substances that you can take, you know. It says, The Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai hath created medicines out of the earth. Okay, so natural. Remedies, and you ain't gonna hear this devil talk about that. Why? Because he's opposed to everything that the Most High has set forth. Okay, the, the order that Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai has set up, this man is against it. That's the reason why he has created this artificial kidney, man. Because he doesn't want to tell people that you can do what the Most High told you to do. Because he's against the Heavenly Father. It says the Lord Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai has created medicines out of the earth, and he that is wise will not abhor them. Okay, but what does the scripture say? The fool hath said in his heart that there is no power. And that's the mindset of Esau Edom. That the Most High, he doesn't know what he's doing. Okay, so I'm not going to acknowledge him as the higher power because he, 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 he doesn't know what he's doing. I'm the one that can do it the proper way. All right? And that's his mindset, man. But you can see, you know, how this man... It's completely contrary to Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Uh, back in Thessalonians 2 and 4, it says, Who opposeth and exalteth himself above all that is called the Most High. So look, this system that the Most High created doesn't work. Okay? You know, you'll always see that when you look up herbs, you know, and different uh, natural remedies, there's always a disclaimer there that says these uh, statements have not been approved by the FDA. Okay? Which the FDA is supposed to be you know, uh, uh, the authority on, on medicine, you know, if the FDA says it doesn't work, then you're supposed to come to the conclusion in your mind that it doesn't work. I need to get something that's approved by Esau. Okay. So this damn devil basically says anything that the most high has created, it doesn't work for you. You need something that I've created. It says who opposes and exalts himself above all that is called the most high or that is worship. So that he as the Most High sitteth in the temple of the Most High, showing himself that he is the Most High. And he's, you know, going to get praise with these different inventions, man. Okay, and you'll actually see this, you know, if you watch uh, these different documentaries. Okay, especially dealing with like health and, and, and medicine. These different doctors, they'll go to, you know, rural parts of the world, you know, or so-called third world countries. And they'll uh, implement their, uh, you know, practices. And they'll, you know, give people a, a, a remedy, you know, through their surgery and whatnot. And these people will praise the doctors, man. They'll actually, you know, uh, look at what's going on as something that's God sent. You know, so if they have a, a, a ailment and Esau is able to fix it, they'll praise the Heavenly Father afterwards, man. You know, and this damn devil just went in there and completely jacked you up. You know, him cutting you open, you know, uh, hitting you with, with chemotherapy. Verse 5, it says, Remember ye not that when I was yet with you, I told you these things. And now you know what withholdeth that he might be revealed in his time. So this is the reason why he wasn't revealed back in that time. Okay, because certain things had to happen. Certain prophecies had to come to pass. So what's going on now could be happening, man. Okay, if this went on during the time of the Roman Empire, this devil wouldn't have been on a level to be doing the things that he's doing now. Okay, the Romans didn't have technology to come up with a bio-artificial kidney. But this damn devil in this damn age, he has that technology. 
It says, and now you know what withhold it, that he might be revealed in his time. And he's being revealed now, man. He's the only nation to come up with devices like this. Okay, and if any nation does create a device like this, they're doing it, you know, after the image that Esau has put out there. Because back in the ancient world, you wouldn't see things going on like this, man. Uh, nations coming up with artificial things to put inside the body to keep it functioning. You know, all these different nations, they have a herbal system that they use, man. Okay, some nations still use it today. The Chinese, the, uh, you know, so-called East Indians. They have a herbal uh, system. Okay, it's only when this damn devil came on the scene that you see the, uh, you know, medicinal system that's in practice right now. Verse 7, it says, For the mystery of iniquity doth already work. Only he whom now letteth will let until he be taken out of the way. Okay, so the Most High is allowing these things to go down. Also, this damn devil can be revealed, man. If you got a, you know, a spiritual eye, you can see... That this man is the devil Okay with these different inventions That he's coming out with So what the hell do you need an artificial kidney for man There are certain things That the Most High created for you To be able to heal yourself man Just as we read in Sirach The 38th chapter Medicines out of the earth It says for the mystery of iniquity Doth already work Only he who now letteth will let Until he be taken out of the way And the Most High is going to take this damn devil out the way it says, and then shall that wicked be revealed, whom the Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, shall consume with the spirit of his mouth. And that's what's happening. Okay, the Most High has sent forth the prophets to chant this man down and expose him. Okay? Only the devil will come up with a device like this, man. And really what this device is, is promoting is, is sin. He's not telling you the root cause of the problem. Why are your organs failing? Why are your kidneys failing? Because of the food that you're putting in your mouth. The food that this damn devil's offering, okay, is GMOs, uh, uh, the unclean food that he promotes, which is a staple here in, in Babylon the Great, and any Edomite-controlled uh, society, you know. It says, And then shall that wicked be revealed, whom the Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, shall consume with the spirit of his mouth the prophets, and shall destroy with the brightness of his coming, which goes into the missiles and the chariots. Verse 9, it says, even him whose coming is after the working of Satan. Okay, so who set this man up? Where does he get, where does he get his power from? From the left-hand side. Okay, and his devices prove where he's getting his power from, man. Because the Most High already set forth the order down here upon the earth. Okay, going back to Genesis, when the angels were creating everything, what did they say after, you know, uh, the creation, after the day was over? They said it's good. Meaning what? It's in order. Okay, all these uh, uh, things that we have set in place is going to work. Okay, it doesn't need to be uh, tampered with. Everything is in order. All right, this damn devil has come on the scene. He's changed that order, man. As it says in uh, Daniel the seventh chapter, he shall think to change laws. Okay, so the order that Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai established, this damn devil has overthrown that. Okay, through the left hand side. It says, even him whose coming is after the working of Satan with all power and signs and lying wonders. Okay, and that's what this device is. This is a lying wonder. When you look up that word lying, the word there is pseudos, which pseudos means false. Okay, see, he, he does false miracles. Okay, because he can't really heal the kidney as, you know, Yahweh Shai would be able to do, as the Most High would be able to do. He can restore your kidney back to how it used to be, you know, uh, before it, it, it got to the point that to where it's at now, man. What is he doing? He's replacing it. You know, he's he's made a device, okay, through his uh, technology to put inside you to replace your kidney, man. And see, it does the same function. Uh, it, it works the same as as your kidney. You know, so you don't need to be uh, on dialysis anymore. All right. But that's not getting to the root of the problem. It's not fixing the problem that you have, man. Okay? Which is that your kidney is not functioning at its, uh, you know, at its uh, uh, capacity. Okay? To where you need a, a, a new kidney. <clears throat> it says, with all power and signs and lying wonders. Okay? 
and with all deceivableness of unrighteousness, and then and them that perish because they receive not the love of the truth that they might be saved. Okay? And see him doing these things, him coming out with devices like this, just as you've seen in the video, you know, he'll get people uh, uh flocking to him, thinking that he's a godsend, man. Okay, so see, he can he can heal our ailments, you know, he, he can he can make our lives better. You know, and these people don't understand that he's the reason why your organs are failing in the first place, man. The food that he has, you know, uh, uh, available to you is destroying you. Okay, the processed foods, the GMOs, you know, the uh, unclean food that he uh, exalts in his society is breaking you down. Okay, see, he's destroying you, but then he's coming with the uh, solution to that destruction that's being caused by you going off. And these people are being deceived by him. They think that the Most High is actually with this guy. You know, he's doing the will of the Most High on the right hand side. Okay, only somebody that, you know, God loves would make something like this to help people. It's to help you, you know. Verse 11, it says, And for this cause the Most High shall send them strong delusion that they should believe a lie. What's the lie? That this damn devil is actually working with the Heavenly Father on the right-hand side to do these things, man. Okay? He's trying to help you out. You know? He just wants to make your life better. Meanwhile, he's pushing sin down your throat, man, which sin is going to cause your body to break down. You know? And eventually it's going to lead to death. Okay? But this is all a part of this man's overall plan, you know, basically saying that you don't need uh, uh, the Most High. You don't need to follow his ways, okay, because I can create things to uh, fix the judgment that comes upon you for committing iniquity. It says that for this cause, the Most High shall send them strong delusion. And these people, you know, that's all caught up into what Esau Edom can do, they're deluded, man. Because they actually believe that the Most High is with this guy. And if you join unto this devil, then you're going to gain favor with the Most High, not knowing that this man is the devil. It says that they should believe a lie and that they all might be damned to believe not the truth, but had pleasure in unrighteousness. Okay? Which is you disobeying the ways of the Heavenly Father. Which that's what Esau Eden promotes. Okay, and we're at the point to where, you know, he's coming up with these uh, lying wonders to try to fix the ailments that you're getting from committing iniquity. Okay, and saying, look, you know, the things that the Most High created, they're flawed. Okay, I can do uh, a better job than what the Most High did. Now, understanding the whole reason behind, you know, the hell that you're catching, man, is because of the sins that you committed. But he's not going to tell you that. All right. The reason why he's not going to tell you that is because he's the devil. And he wants to, you know, lead you down that path of wickedness. You know, so I just want to go into that. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai willing. It was edifying. I want to give all praises to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Bashim Yahweh Hakadash. Double honors to the elders and apostles at Great Millstone. Shalom.